case one, two, and three. Case one being the best weather, which we'll do at daytime, and then case three, which is what you'll do at night, or bad weather. Case two being kind of the marginal. We can bring you in on an approach, get you close to the ship, and then you can do a VFR pattern. That's what we'll do. But case three is, okay, we're dropped below VFR. Now we're going to bring everybody in on pretty much a, a straight end. So kind of lengthy explanation on how they do all that. Basically, they'll have you on an extended center line a couple of degrees off, and they'll kind of hold, they'll rack and stack everybody and bring everybody in about 60 seconds at a time. So everybody's separated. And then what they will do is you get within a few miles of the ship, you have either needles or bullseye. ACLS, which is basically an aircraft carrier landing system, as we would call, uh, put the bathtub inside the velocity vector. So it's essentially a needle that will show up with a little circle that you will fly, which you can picture this kind of 3D geometry of what on and on would look like all the way down. So as this circle in your HUD starts to go above the velocity vector, you're below glide path. And then basically you want that circle inside the velocity vector all the way to touchdown, or you have your standard ILS needles. So we will use those. Sometimes we'll use both of those in kind of a bad weather situation. We'll keep them on and on. So you got your ILS needles and your ACLS dot per se that will basically have the airplane flying all the way down to touchdown.